We have just watched Deadpool 2. And that's right, and our no spoiler review is coming right up. Lead them tough, morally flexible, and young enough to carry their own franchise for 10 to 12 years. We will be known as X-Force. Isn't that a little derivative? You're absolutely right. Hi guys, in the words of uh, Deadpool, it lives up to the hype. Plus, plus. Well, does it? That is the big question. We have just come out from seeing Deadpool 2. As we said already, this is our no spoiler review. And the first thing I can say, hand on heart, was I ain't the biggest Deadpool fan. I did enjoy the first one, but boy, was this bigger. It was, you know, oh, yeah. it felt much more polished. But it should yeah. do. They had so much more good. money to spend. Obviously, the first one being a hit, they had a lot more backing. Yeah, yeah. so many, really. like, five, six, seven hundred million <laughs> that they made from that first one. And that yeah. was done on a tight budget. And you could see the difference straight away because they had all the sword fighting going on in the first one. Less That's of that it. this There's time. There's more CGI and um, special effects. and uh, Everything's bigger, better. and uh, Free-flowing. That's the good way to put it. I was actually worried yeah, about that as well. Um, that's true. Yeah, so this whole, this the, the, the bigger is good. You expect that naturally. But leading on to that, if you're not already actually aware, this is all centered around the, the kid um, and Cable, primarily. That's right, yeah. Um, it's quite common knowledge that uh, Cable wants to come back in time and kill the kid. Um, we're not spoiling anything by saying that. I don't think no, no, I don't think you're spoiling it, but that no. is a, he is a time traveller. He is a time traveller. We knew that. Um, and Deadpool obviously wants to. He has to save the day. It's kind of like if you're so. familiar with Terminator. There you go. That's your storyline. Right that, there. That right there. Or Terminator yeah. 2. Come back in time, kill the kid. Yeah. What reason for, we'll leave that up to everyone else's imagination. Yeah. But no, um, uh, going on to C Cable, I mean, the kid, as much as you've seen, but Cable, I was a little bit disappointed. I would have personally liked to have seen a little bit more of Josh Brolin's Cable. Yeah, but there is the fact that he's come back into three more films, and he stated that this is just like the tip of the iceberg just introducing him yeah so. I didn't actually know that until you mentioned it what yeah. I did know is that Ryan Reynolds and Josh Brolin who plays Cable have actually signed up to the new X-Force this obviously yeah. leads into seeing how we're going to you know, find yeah. out how X-Force becomes as you saw in the trailer we're, we're creating yeah. the X-Force yeah in the film you'll see how it links in how the future is going to unfold there um, so I can't really say much more than that. No, you that can't say it, much but, more, but the good thing um, is they are tied into more films, and yet again, so, Ryan... Yeah, it's, and yeah, not, it's a Marvel franchise, isn't it? Through, and not only... Yeah, but not so. only even going from Cable, Ryan Reynolds this week has come out himself and said they have confirmed there is going to be a Deadpool 3, which is yeah. great news, because this yeah. film isn't the worst. It leads on nicely from the first. Yeah, they could do... I feel, from a story point of view, they could have done a bit more of it. It's not that it was mm. flat... This is pure entertainment and comedy gold. Yeah, I guess it's a bit like watching it, like Pirates of Caribbean or something. If you get to the middle films, sometimes you just feel like you want it an ending, but sometimes the odd bits carry on, don't they? For the next film, which when you get the next film is brilliant. So Yeah, um, and it's well directed as well. I must yeah. add that. I mean, David Leach oh, yeah. is coming from the other yeah. Deadpool, I believe. Uh, John, got that oh. kind of John Wick kind of uh, atomic yeah. blonde film feel you can see he's brought that in yeah the cinematics and the slow motion and timing of everything um and to keep up with ryan reynolds obviously dropping whatever he wants to put in there <laughs> he he <laughs> makes that character yet again he's yeah. talked recently i mean this character will it is you know dictating his life let's be honest leading up to this film we didn't just yeah. see one or two or three trailers you saw about 45 dozen other odd little spoof kind of clips that's it yeah but um it's like um you don't actually get it's not that you see the yeah. clips obviously in the film no and some of the no. trailer parts aren't that's in it. the film either no i was expecting no. them all to be in there but there are lots and lots of clips in there and they cover like dc marvel characters <laughs> Pretty well, all of them in the film. If he you want, takes the mic. Yeah, or... taking the Mickey is what he does, <laughs> and this is he does it way, well. Yeah, he does it well and more. Yeah. He does yeah. it more, but it's done yeah. cleverly. It really is, and it's, it's free flowing. It works well. Yeah. I was worried about that. Seeing all these trailers, how they keep like 
or how he keeps like taking the mickey out, all these different things. And I was like, I hope he doesn't do that too much in the film. But the way that they did incorporate it, I was actually pleasantly surprised. Yeah, I mean, you, from the first film, you know what it's going to be like most of the way through. Um, but adding the superhero to all the comedy really makes it a full film. I really yeah, enjoy Yeah, you, you obviously get to see a little bit more of these characters yeah. and none other than, um, oh, the lady's name, uh, played by Zazie Beats, Domino. Oh, yeah. She was the yeah. surprise addition. Miss, for me. Miss Sort of Lucky, yeah. Uh, Miss Luck. Yeah. Um, yeah. 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 She, yeah, we won't so say special. much more. Yeah. But she yeah. was my... I, I, yeah. think, I think she was better than Cable. I don't know. That's just me. Yeah. I, I wasn't expecting yeah. to be... Not that she's no. like dictating the whole film and she's centred, but you know, no. as a side kind of character, you know, as a supporting character. Yeah. I mean, you did see a lot more about Deadpool um, as his character Wade um, with the mask off and actually going in depth about him rather than the, the Deadpool character. He's doing a lot of talking and things about himself, making it a bit deeper. Yeah. Um, but that's where we missed out with Cable because I think there wasn't that much in depth about him. No, it wasn't as much in depth, but you know, it's like I say, but see, he's, see, been, he's he, been attacked all the time. <laughs> yeah, he was. Well, he's after the kid, and that's primarily it. Deadpool's yeah. got to stop him. But the good thing is, we are going to see a lot more of these characters going through, and obviously, where this is going to expand from here, we don't really know because Disney mm. are trying to buy out Fox, the Marvel Universe, the MCU yeah. could get. Massive. It, it could change. Tie, it could yeah. change. It could That's tie it. into the X Men. I know other yeah. companies or another big company out there is trying to take yeah. hold of the Fox franchise. Hopefully, it might be Disney, and then we could all see Deadpool meet Wolverine if Hugh Jackman would come back and play Wolverine. Because that'd be awesome. It could do. Yeah. Happen, but that would be. That <laughs> no, that's for sure. He's about. finished. He's done with Logan. I know, but still, oh. it'll be good to see. Us. But overall, but, yeah. It, oh man. I enjoyed it so we both um, enjoyed it and if yeah, you are a Deadpool fan a, you will like it if it's you, a given if you if you, uh, if you like the first one you're going to love the second one you're going to love see. it whether it's going to be yeah. something you'll keep watching over and over like for me I like the first one I yeah. couldn't keep watching it over and over I'm not sure if I could keep watching this over and over no for longer it might be one you could watch again and because so many clips in it, you might catch a bit more than you did the first time. I'm not sure what There is a lot going on. Yeah. There is a lot, especially in the middle part of yeah. the film, there is a lot going on. And But ultimately, if you're wondering, if is it worth it? Does it beat the first? Yes, it does on all, all counts there. I think so, But yeah. it's not going to be the film of the year. It's not tied in. This is an entertaining film compared to like with the Avengers film. That's story-driven. This isn't as much story-driven. <laughs> That is my. No, it's Ryan Reynolds. It's Ryan Reynolds. And yeah, uh, I think we'll leave that right there. If you like the video, give us a like. Are you going to go and see the film? Let us know in the comments below. And we'll see you real soon. Catch you on the flip side.